What's up, y'all? Welcome back to another video with Hanging with Y'all Sheikah. Before we jump into this video, you guys, I would like to wish y'all a happy 2024. Wishing you guys nothing but blessings on top of blessings on top of blessings. Okay? So, y'all, y'all already know, if you haven't subscribed, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Okay? So... This video is gonna be a little chit chat because as y'all see the thumbnail, honey, fragrance alert, fragrance alert, honey. Y'all know I have been on a no buy, but baby, let's get ready to change. So if you wanna know what we get ready to chit chat about, just keep on watching, pal. Okay, y'all, look, as y'all can see, honey, it's some fragrances, honey, that's coming out. Some of it are already out right now. So y'all, I gotta get my nose on some of these fragrances. So look, that's what we get ready to do. We get ready to chit chat. So go grab a snack, grab a drink or something and come on back and let's chop it up, okay? So look, we got a couple of fragrances that I want to get my nose on for 2024, okay? So we're gonna talk about it. So first y'all, is clean reserve. Y'all already know I am a huge, huge fan of Clean Reserve. Y'all know I am a fresh type of chick. I like fresh aquatic soft scent, especially around the summertime. I do not like to wear heavy fragrances in the summertime. So Clean Reserve is right up my alley. And honey, they have a waterline H2. I think it's H2O or something like that. Y'all. I got to get my nose on them, okay? So y'all, look, the first one they have, they have eight new fragrances, okay? And this is Clean Reserve Collection. The first one is Nectarine Petal, and I will put a picture up so you guys can see. So the first one is Nectarine Petal, the top notes is Nectarine, Golden Chamomile, and Bergamot. Mid notes is Peach Blossom, Optimus, and Maracuja. I might tear that up, y'all. Tear that up. And the dry down is musk, white wood, and amber. Look, sounds so divine, okay? The next one is golden citrus. Top notes is mandarin, bergamot, aqua accord. Middle notes is orange blossom, neroli, and jasmine. The dry notes is musk, wood, and amber. The next one is Musk Nior. The top notes is Lily, Violet, and Musk. The middle notes is Musk, Vanilla, and Amber. The dry down is Sandalwood and Patchouli and Musk. Okay, the next one is Waterfall. Top notes is Aquatic Accord, Green Mandarin. Mid notes is Apple Blossom, Watermelon, and Helotrope. The dry down is vetiver, amber, and musk. The next one is water lotus. The top notes is water lily, cucumber, water, mandarin. The mid notes is muguet, apple blossom, and peony. And the dry down is musk, amber, and driftwood. Y'all, look, before I get into the next section, Y'all, these scents sound so amazing. Clean Reserve is like a clean fragrance house. No harsh chemicals. If you into like that clean type of scent, skin to skin, but you still can smell. That's one thing I can't say about Clean Reserve. They stuff is skin to skin, but you still can smell them, okay? And other people can smell it on you as well. I love Clean Reserve fragrances. Love them so much, okay? So if you into that skin to skin, light fragrance, must, you know what I'm saying? You have to be into this type of fragrance, okay? But y'all, I'm excited because this right here is right up my alley around the summertime, okay? So next, they have Amber Cashmere, and the top notes is Robust, I guess I'm saying that right, Robust Tea, Neroli, and Bergamot. The mid notes is Daisy and Magnolia and Helotrope. The dry down is Amber, Vanilla, and Musk. Brilliant Peony. Top notes is Peony, Amber, and Bergamot. The mid notes is Magnolia and Fruit Accord. 
The dry down is musk and sandalwood. The next one is emerald oasis. The top notes is bergamot, grapefruit, aquatic accord. The mid notes is orange blossom, mandarin, and cedarwood. And the dry down is vetiver, sandalwood, and musk. Y'all, I cannot wait to get my hands on the Clean Reserve Collection. They have eight new fragrances. They out right now. I actually ordered a discovery set of all eight of these fragrances. So be watching out because I am going to do a first impression of the eight new fragrances so I can see which one I want to buy in a full size. Okay, so if you enter Clean Reserve, Hey, go check them out. I'm telling you, this is a good, clean line. Okay, love it. So next up, y'all, I'm telling you, the fragrance world is booming. Okay, booming, 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 honey. And I'm just excited to get my nose on some of these fragrances. Okay, so Mark Jacobs has three fragrances that he has. I don't know. I, yeah, they are out. They have been released. Okay. So the first one is, and I think they limited edition, is Daisy Pop, okay? So the notes for Daisy Pop is grapefruit, yuzu, and violet leaf accord. That's the top note. The heart note is jasmine, kumquat, and violet accord. The base note is musk with pamplewood and vanilla accord, okay? I would like to get my nose on these from Mark Jacobs. Okay, the next one is Daisy Oh So Fresh. And y'all know I'm really excited to smell this one. And the top notes for Oh So Fresh is lemon with pear and lime accords. The heart notes is rose with raspberry and violet accords. And the base notes is musk and crystal moss and cedarwood accord. And I do not have no daisies in my collection. I have perfect but that's it, I don't have no daisy. So I would like to smell these and see which one fits the bill. And the last one for Marc Jacobs is Daisy Love. And this one sounds so delicious, okay? And the top notes is cloudberry, raspberry, and bergamot. Okay, so the heart notes is pistachio, chantilly, and daisy tree petal accords. And the base is sorbetalide, benzoin, and driftwood accord, okay? This one sounds kind of yummy. It got pistachio, chantilly, cloudberry, raspberry, bergamot. This one sounds very interesting, okay? So I can't wait to get my nose on these three. I want to smell them, okay? So I'm excited about Marc Jacobs. Like I said, I don't have no daisies in my collection. So I want to smell those to see which one I like okay so the next perfume that's out and I think this is sold out right now and that's Fleur mood ring and this is like a fruity floral scent and the top notes is Pattaya pup sweet orange fruit gummies the heart notes is orange flower jasmine sandback and marigold bloom and the base notes is patchouli prisma glazed musk and sheer Amber. I would like to get a travel size and mood ring. Okay, y'all know I love my fruity floral scents. So I want to get a trial size to see what it's giving. The next one is YSL Black Opium Out of Parfum Over Red. I don't have no black opium. I actually want to get the black opium that came out before this one because that has a lot of vanilla in it. So I do want to get trial size of that one as well. And I do want to try this one. For some reason, I want to try this one too. And the scent notes is warm, sweet gourmands. Key notes is cherry accord, coffee accord, and vanilla infusion. So this is like a, a coffee, vanilla, cherry type of scent, I guess. I have seen like mixed views on this scent. I think I've seen like two people or whatever, but I want to get a trial size, okay? Just to smell it. And let's see. Also, Nicki Minaj, Pink Friday 2. I've been trying to get that perfume and it's been sold out in my area. The only thing that they have left is the trial size. So I might have to buy the trial size since I can't get the full bottle. 
But Annette came out 2023, and the notes for that one is nectarine, pineapple, and solar bloom with orange flower, petals, pink mimosa, and damask rose, amber, tonka bean, and sexy musk make up the base notes. Y'all, that sounds so good, okay? I can't wait to smell Pink Friday too. And plus, I am in love with the album. I play that album every day, every day at work. It ain't a day at work that I don't play Pink Friday 2 from top to bottom, okay? So it's only right that I get my hands on Pink Friday 2 perfume. So let's see, what else you guys? Charosa 59. I feel like that's a tongue tie every time I say that word, okay? It's like it just tied my tongue and I can't get it out right. So, and this is out right now, if I'm not mistaken. But this is an amber vanilla fragrance. It's powdery, sweet, woody, violet, floral, vanilla, warm, spicy. It said the top note is vanilla orchid. Middle notes are sugar and violet and the base notes in sandalwood. I cannot wait to smell this. I'm going to buy this, period. Because the notes is just calling my name. But a lot of these things I'm going to get like the 10 mil. But I think Mark Jacobs, I don't think they'll come in a um, 10 mil if I'm not mistaken. But if you do, I will get that. But I plan on going into the store to actually smell them just to see which one I like the best. So yeah, y'all. Oh, one more. How can I forget? The most important one of them all, Bellatino, y'all. Y'all know I love me some Bellatino born in Roma. They is coming out with Born in Roma, Donna Green Stravaganza. They coming out with the men line and the women, okay? So the notes is Lapsang, Suchong, y'all, I don't know if I'm saying that right. Suchong Accord. The middle notes is Jasmine Absolute. And the base note is vanilla extract. And they say this is a feminine offering set of off with Lapsang Suchong, a sweet, refreshing, yet smoky accord that adds a crisp vibe upon the initial blast, soon followed by a delicate heart of Jasmine Absolute for a long lasting floral complexity that elevates the blend. It thickens even further to unfold the creamy base of vanilla extract that adds intensity and depth to the whole blend. Y'all, I cannot wait to smell this Born in Roma Donna Green Stravaganza. For some reason, I think this is really going to be an interesting scent, okay? And I'm just at odd, okay, to see what this is really going to smell like. I cannot wait. So, y'all, I think that's all the fragrances that's out and coming out that I want to smell. I know Ness came out with a lychee rose, if I'm not mistaken. I kind of want to smell that too, but since I already bought the K.I.L.E. Eden Sparkling Lychee, I don't know, do I really need to get Ness? lychee rose but i heard some people well i only seen one review and she said that it was not the same like you can have both but i don't know so but if i'm in the store and i happen to see it i will put my nose on it but i'm not sure about that one just yet because i love the kali eating sparkling lychee love it love it okay wore it last night at work got hella compliments on it okay so y'all, I think that's everything that I want to put my nose on and smell to see, honey, if these people gonna get these coins, okay? Cause y'all know I've been on this no buy and baby, I'm ready to splurge on some fragrances, okay? They call it my name on top of some fragrances that I already wanna get besides the new new okay so y'all drop in the comments and let me know if y'all interested in any one of these fragrances that i mentioned if it's a fragrance that's out that's coming out that i didn't mention drop that in the comments 
So yeah, y'all, I hope that's it. Well, I think that is it, you guys. So y'all make sure y'all smash on that subscribe button. Make sure you thumbs up. Please thumbs up the video. That lets me know you support my channel and like the content that I am bringing you. Share, share, share. And please always leave a comment because y'all know we chops it up in the comments. And I hope y'all have a blessed and wonderful day. And honey, I guess I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace.